Did I give you a parsnip yesterday? If not, here, it's for my first harvest. I know you want to get inside. Hey! Hey! Mm. Oh, that's... Oh, oh, oh hi. Uh, <laughs> didn't see you there. Welcome. Welcome back to the Punchwood Farm here in Stardew Valley. I was just enjoying a little porridge and coffee. Oh, gosh. Wait, no coffee. Dang it. When do I get coffee? I want coffee. I need coffee. All right. Anyway, welcome back, everybody. Punchwood Farm here. Stardew Valley. Let's check the weather. Today's supposed to be a nice day, I think. So, yeah. Tomorrow will be a nice day as well. And our fortune for the day is... Oh, no. Spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Luck will not be on our side. Okay. Well, I'll stay away from power tools. And I won't shave. Oh, wait. I never shave. Whatever. Let's go. We got lots... Oh! Hi! Fella. You are... Clint! Uh, hi there. Good morning. I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. Yeah, in fact, you way overcharged me, man. I want a refund. If you want to get the most out of the ores you find, you'll need a furnace. Okay. Just so happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying around. Here, I want you to have them. Oh, I see. You're making up for that ridiculously expensive service that you charge for whacking stones. Learn how to craft a furnace. That's nice. Thank you. I appreciate it, Clint. You're a good guy. I don't care what they say. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. Excellent. I can't wait. What? Oh, you're about to go. You have something else on your mind? Go ahead. Spit it out. <laughs> when you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make your work a lot easier. Oh, here comes the pitch. Oh, I see. So you're trying to sell me your really expensive services again, are you? Well, okay. I'm heading home. Take it easy. I see right through you, Clint. I see right... Where's he? He's gone. All right. Uh, see ya. Anyway, we have a new journal entry here. He's a good guy. He's not that bad, actually. Forging ahead. If you're going to keep mining, you should build a furnace. Yes, we're going to craft a furnace very soon. What else do we have to do? All right, go deeper in the mines. Reach farming level one. So we just have to farm for that. We've got to raise animals by building a coop. And we still have to meet a few more people. Seven more people. But first, let's check ye old mailbox. It's from Marlin. Our good buddy at the Adventurers Guild. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the Adventurers spirit that much I can tell. If you can slay ten slimes, you'll have earned your place in my Adventurers Guild. Be careful, Marlin. He sounds suspiciously like the uh, fisherman, Willie, doesn't he? <laughs> I can't keep track of all these voices, I'm sorry. Oh, look, an advertisement. I got spam. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does it sound like you? Well, Piers got you covered. Stop by Piers General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. <laughs> See you soon. <laughs> Great, we got our first piece of junk mail. All right, what are we going to do today? Uh, let's put the copper ore away. We can't do any smelting yet. So I'm not going to... Um, we can't do anything with that. But I am going to take the amethyst, the topaz, and the earth crystal. But not right now because we have a few other things to do. Actually, let's go and uh, take care of our, our plants first, our crops. That is the number one thing to do here. Um, yeah, let's go do that first. And then we'll head to town and go donate some of these minerals and, and things that we found in the mines last time, which was awesome. So we'll just water up the little plants here. Oh, look at the tulips are coming in nicely. We'll be giving those away as gifts pretty soon. In fact, I think... Uh, I just want to get that one little spot wet. It was annoying me. Um, yeah, tomorrow on the 7th, I believe it is... Lewis's birthday, right? So we definitely want to give him a gift. So, let's take a look at that uh, that recipe right now, in fact. So we got some new recipes, didn't we? A field snack. We just need a pine cone. Here's the furnace. Copper ore and 25 stone. So we don't have enough to make that just yet, but I'm happy that we can. Then we can start smelting the copper ores into copper bars and getting better tools, so forth and so on. Do we have any wood? We've got a little bit of wood here. I think I'm going to make... Uh, let's just make a little bit more of this wooden fence. And then we're going to we're gonna expand on the farm here just a little. Bring that down a couple. Maybe one more. Oh, look, it's a little parsnip is up. It's the little runt guy. Oh, hi. Oh, I'm so happy you finally grew up. He was all by himself. And now he's with his friends again. A little stacked up with his little buddies. And I need one more fence down there to match it all up. All right, let's, uh, let's check for... Whoops. 
Let's check for, um, I want a pine cone. I want to make me a snack. I'll just shake this guy. Oh, oh, I got it! A pine cone! It's a seed. Place this on your farm to plant trees, but I don't want to do that. I actually want to make my trail snack. And we'll just shake a few more trees. You know what? I think I can use my sword for that. That's nice. All right, a little, a little more dirt, and we're going to get on our way. I know this isn't the most exciting thing, but a little bit at a time. We have to do this. We have to tackle every day just a, a little more cleanup on the farm because the whole thing, doing it all at once is... A, whoa! Oh, I got an acorn right out of the ground. There was a little one growing. That's what those are. Oh, I didn't know that. It's cool. Well, let's go get more. Yeah, so a little bit at a time so, the, so we don't get overwhelmed with this massive uh, task ahead of us. So, what time is it? 9.20. Wait, what's going on here? Initiation. Oh, that was from Marlin, says Kill Ten Slimes. Okay, we can do that. Now, that little fella right there. Got him. Yeah, it's a maple seed. Sweet. There's a sapling growing there. I'm going to let that go. Oh, here's another little guy. So that... Oop, missed. That's where you get them. You can get them from the ground. You can shake them out of the trees. I like. So, let's make... Actually, get rid of that. Let us make... Ooh, cold, nice. Let's make a trail snack. You ready? <gasps> there is field snack! Yay! Let's see it. Oh, wow, I love it! It looks like a... Looks like a chocolate pop, doesn't it? This is like the wrapper. I opened it up, but that's chocolate. Chocolate ice cream. Mmm, delish. Fudge pop. It's a fudge pop! <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna keep the fudge pop in my pockets right now, because I want to have space for other things so we're gonna toss it in here right now okay that looks good let's head into town it's 10 o'clock it's actually very early so we get a nice early start in town maybe we'll bump into some of the people that we haven't met yet and just looking around over here for any kind of uh special growth you know what i'm curious about this thing though the bus to calico desert is out of service oh that's too bad yeah the bus is busted up and then we have a um, out-of-order mine cart and rail. Interesting. So we'll have to get that activated at some point. All right. Let's head into town. We're going to go over to the museum and donate every one of these minerals. Don't worry. We'll find more. It's kind of a bummer giving away your first minerals, but it's worth it. Trust me. We're going to get some goodies from the... Uh, from the curator. Now we have something going on here. Help wanted. Need a small moth. Small moth? <laughs> a small moth to pickle. Uh, a small mouth bass to pickle. Clint, 150 gold on delivery. That's not bad. I bet we can catch one of those. I, I seem to find them quite often. Um, yeah, let's go do the donation first so I can clear up some of my inventory here. I was going to go buy some stuff up here. We'll stop and say hello to Alex. Hello, Alex. How you doing? My arms are really sore, but that's the sign of progress for a guy like me. Yeah, you've been working out, I can tell. I must have done a thousand push-ups yesterday. Ooh, a thousand. Dang. I could do two thousand. Now, I'm going to stop off real quick here and see if uh, Penny's around. Oh, hi, Pam. Is your daughter here? Make sure your boots are clean before you go stomping around in my house. <laughs> how mad she is. I wiped them. I promise. And Penny's not here, so I'm going to go now. Goodbye. I'm going to give Penny a parsnip. Because I have one more gift to give to Penny and Leah, if we bump into her again, um, for this week. And then the week's going to recycle in a day anyway, so... Better do that before we run out of time. Alright, let's head inside over here. Oh, what's up? It's the curator, Gunther. He's way over there. He's very sad that all of his uh, abysmal, <laughs> all of his, um, all of his attractions have been stolen. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. I'm so sorry about that, Gunther, but perhaps I can help you. I've got some things here. You might be interested. What? Really? What's this? You found something. Let me see it. Now keep your pants on, old... Oh, yeah. He's rubbing it. Remarkable! It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? 
If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Sure, I think that's a pretty good deal. Think about it, will ya? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front of the desk. To the front desk. Um, yep, that's why I'm here. Okay. You're behind your desk, and Gunther, I have some things for you. So now we click on Donate to Museum, and we get to choose what we want to donate and where to put them. So we're going to give, uh, all, we're going to put all the minerals, like, uh, we'll put them right here. Yay, journal updated. We'll give them this one, too. There we go, awesome. Okay, and there we go, Gunther. You now have three. Attractions. <laughs> check them out. That's so great. All right, now let's check the journal. See what happened here. Archaeology was done. Gunther asked if you if you'd consider donating any new artifacts and minerals you find in the museum. He's yeah. All right. Okay. Two fifty. Not a bad haul, huh? I don't know if he gives you stuff every single time. Sometimes he does. Sometimes he doesn't. There's a book missing here. Someone stole a book. We're gonna have to find it. All right, you know what? Hey, Linus had a book, didn't he? Uh, what else can we do with you? It doesn't seem like you have anything to donate to the museum. Better get out there and do some treasure hunting, huh? Sure. Wow, greedy. One greedy guy. All right, let's get out of here. Um, let's see if we can't catch a smallmouth bass. Ooh, who's this? Oh! Oh, I'm gonna. S I'm not. Well, Lewis. Hey, buddy. Just want to chat for one quick sec. Might as well talk to him. Everyone seems a little happier on the weekends, don't you think? Yep. Oh, it is Saturday. I forgot. I'm on the job. Oh, I clicked that too fast. I forgot that it is Saturday. Yeah. So nobody's gonna be working. We can just. Whoops. Here, let's um. Let's see if we can catch a bass in the river. A small mouth. It will run it right over to Clint real quick. So we can pickle it. Here, fishy, fishy. Oh, look at the worms. The little wormies over there. You see them? To the right of the bridge. Let's see if I can go snag them. Maybe I'll put them on my... Oh, dang, we got green algae. Ugh. Come on. Oh, arr. Nope, can't take them. They just sit there. Can't axe them, can't swipe them. The fishing's not very good right now, guys. It's getting late, and I've only caught two things so far. Seaweed and a broken CD, and oh my gosh, really? Oh, we got a hit! We got a hit! It's a fish. Finally. I have three pieces of trash so far. Lewis, don't you bug me right now. And don't, just don't, whatever you do, don't get in the way. Don't touch my line, don't hit the pole. Look at you, what'd you, oh, oh man. Arr, distractions. Oh man, I'm gonna catch this thing. <laughs> Yay! I got a smallmouth bass that's a foot long! Wow! That's a big one. Let's go give it to Clint before he closes. Oh no, he closed! Oh, shots. <laughs> he closed! I just missed! 20 past. I'll catch him at the bar. He's gonna come out. His furnace is still cranking. Oh man, you know what? Saturday... In the afternoon, he's probably going to go to the saloon and have a drink or two. Can I, can I drink? Can I eat this? Oh, I can eat the algae. Hey! It's Willie! Isn't that Willie? Willie's fishing down here. And Elliot's watching. Hello, Willie. Ahoy there. It's nice to see young folk moving into the valley. It's not very common these days. No, it isn't. Did you catch anything? How are they biting? Here, mind if I fish next to you? This is probably really annoying for a fisherman. Well, as a fisherman, yes, this would be extremely obnoxious and unethical. <laughs> I'm catching the fish right next to Willy. <laughs> I don't know how yours is biting, Willy, but mine's biting pretty good. If I can get up in that little treasure chest, you get a treasure. It's a sunfish, eight inches. Beat that, Willy. <laughs> and check out my foot long. Oh, no, you can't have it. Stop. Stop looking at me like that. Catch your own fish. Sheesh. What's up, Elliot? You probably wouldn't like it. Inside my cabin is dark and full of spiders. Sounds... Uh, yicky. Yeah, I guess I wouldn't. I'm still waiting for Clint because I want to give him his fish. 
All right, let's head up to town and see if Clint is in the saloon. He goes, is that Marlin? Marley? Going in. Uh, no, he's not here yet, but I bet he's going to be here later. All right, let's have a seat here. Oh, I can't sit. Let's just have a chat with people. I'm going to give away some of my parsnips. I always see Clint here, but he won't talk to anyone. He just glances over his shoulder now and then. You know, Marty, I was just going to ask you what time Clint comes in. I always see Clint. Okay, thanks. <gasps> it's Leah. This is Leah. I think. Whoa, sorry. <laughs> just sliced her. Oh my gosh. Leah, tap, tap, tap on your shoulder. <laughs> I love to decorate for the seasons. Different seasons. Oh, you know what? I do too. In fact, here. I want to give you one of my first harvest... Leah? It's a parsnip. Matches your eyes. <laughs> this is a really nice gift. Thank you. Oh, look how happy she is. She loves parsnips. She does love getting vegetables. She she likes vegetables. Um, and I'm not sure about fruits, but vegetables and flowers. It's pretty much a universal like. Everybody likes that kind of stuff. Pam's not responding. She's half in the bag. We'll leave her alone. Um... Who's this? Gus. Good evening. Can I get you anything? Uh, sure. You know, actually, I think I will buy something, but I have to come around to the front and make it all official like. Yeah, here we go. A bit 400 bucks for a beer? You cads, man. I hope you handcrafted it yourself. That is a lot of money. Spaghetti? <laughs> Somebody must like this. Oh, there's my coffee. There's the coffee that I've desired so greatly this morning. Omelette. Oh, look, you can make re uh, buy recipes. From this guy. Tortilla. Fried mushrooms. Nah. You know what? I, I need my cash. Um, I need to save it for something. Is that... Oh, that's uh, that's Willie. Willie, how how the fishing go? Ah, uh, nothing's better than kicking back with a cold one after a relaxing day fishing. Yeah. Um, I'd tell you my fish story, but you probably wouldn't believe it, Willie. Where's that Clint? I got something for him. It's getting late. Oh, here he is. Clint, I've been waiting here all night for you. I've got your thing. Turn around, talk to me. Sometimes I wonder how I ended up in this town. It's all right, look it. This will make you happy. Is that the right one? That's a sunfish. Here, it's a foot long. Oh, you brought me the item I asked for. It looks perfect. Let's see. Here's what I owe you. Yeah. What? Delivery. Here we go, 150. Clint will be thankful, so we're going to get some uh, some favor there too let's see if we got a heart with Clint nope not yet dang man you people these people are hardcore well I've given Leah two gifts this week I still want to give Penny one before the week uh, recycles all right uh, eh, that's Shane I don't want to talk to him this is the arcade over here this is kind of nice I'll play a game this one's out of order. Let's try this one right here. The pra Journey of the Prairie King. Press space. Oh, well, here we go. Wazdy moves. Oh, I got a little cowboy. I have, I have not played this yet. Oh, nope. Don't use your mouse. Oh. Oh, I'm shooting. I'm shooting, all right. I'm a cowboy. Woo! It's like Space Invaders. Uh, no, but not really. Space is an item. Oh, I can... I get, like, a special item. Like, maybe a bomb. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got this now. I'm just shooting everywhere. Do, 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 do. <laughs> it's kind of like Berserker? Space Invaders kind of thing? All mixed... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! It's, it's overrun with zombies. Can I run through here? No, I can't run through there. <laughs> Alright, last one. I think this is my last life. Can I shoot diagonal? Oh, I can shoot on the run! No way! Oh, why didn't they tell me that before? Oh, I was stuck on something. Uh, no! Oh! All right, I don't think I get the high score. Terrible. Oh, my last life. Here we go. Okay. Yep. I'm getting good at this now. Oh, wagon wheel. Oh, dang. It was a wagon wheel. Arr. No, I quit. I haven't got any time for this nonsense. Too old for these video games, apparently. All right, night all. I'm going to trudge back home to the Punchwood Farm and probably hang this fish up on my wall, Willie. It's a big one, right? Willie, you know what? I like you, Willie. Here, you can have it. A gift? Thanks! Yeah, I, I, I know that you didn't catch one on the bridge today. I mean, on the shoreline, and I'm really sad about that. That I walked right up and caught that right in front of you. So, there. 
Uh, peace offering. Okay, enjoy your fish. <laughs> I probably just sold it, but whatever. I want to be nice to people. I want them to like me. I want to get hearts. Will they give me a heart? Nope, not yet. Because, you know, pretty soon, the dance is going to be here. And I'm gonna need, uh, I need, I'm gonna need a partner to dance with. Wait, stop. Right here. Flower dance. So, that time's gonna go by fast. You'll see. And we gotta get some hearts stored away. Lewis's birthday tomorrow. I'm gonna give him probably a parsnip. And I'm gonna give you a parsnip. Stop! Stop. Stop. <laughs> Hi, Abigail. The fresh mountain air is nice on a day like today. It truly is. Did I give you a parsnip yesterday? If not here, it's for my first harvest. I know you want to get inside. Hey! Hey! Shit! I want a parsnip! Oh my gosh! She just pulled it right around me! Maybe she doesn't like parsnips. Yeah, I'll catch her tomorrow. It's the last day of the week before it resets. So many gifts have I given Abigail so far? Yeah, I want to give her one more tomorrow. Sheesh. That was rude. Okay, well, we'll head back to the farm. A lot of fun today, taunting the uh, the Pelican Town citizens. <laughs> it's no wonder they don't like me. All right, we're going to do a little bit more work around here because um, someone pointed out that I can pick these up and put them on the fences. Oh, no! I don't want to do that. I'll fix that later. So, oh, that's cool. Yeah, it works. Very nice! Now, can I take that with an axe, too? Oh, yeah, I guess I can take that with anything. Yeah, so you place it on the bottom of the fence. Cool. And I think I'm going to make a couple more. What time is it? Oh, shoot. I can't see it right now. Um, let's make a couple more torches real quick here. Because I want to place some in... Like, I want to put one over here. It's all red. Oh, here we go. Put one on my porch. Yeah! Yeah! Safety torch! Put it on the porch! Uh, no, I do not watch Tabuscus. That, I swear to God, my son watches Tabuscus, not me. And, <laughs> and he doesn't watch him anymore. It was a long time ago. He's not a bad guy, that Tabuscus. He's alright. Anyway, I think we are done here. Um, can I make a campfire yet? Oh, I need ten wood. We'll do that tomorrow. I want to get to bed before midnight. Because I turn into a, uh, a rooster. Whew! Made it. Alright, that's it for uh, Saturday the 6th. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And we'll see you on Sunday. Good night. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's see what we got. I should have sold a fish and made some money, but... Yeah, but I gave it away. We got nothing. You get nothing for that stuff. For junk. Should have known better.